A spark, by definition, is a small fiery particle thrown off from a fire or a trace of an intense feeling. A spark to me, however, means an open door. An open door that was once closed and never thought or imagined to ever be opened. An open door that only took two generous, caring, and gracious people to open. That open door is opportunity, and those two benevolent people were Milton and Catherine Hershey. Milton and Kitty Hershey lived in an enormous mansion and made millions of dollars a year. That's more than many of us here can imagine. And yet they still yearned for something they could not have, children. Their desire for children grew so intense that they decided to create a school for orphaned boys. Today, the Milton Hershey School has served over 10,000 male and female students and has helped many more children in need. Their legacy lives on and is the spark of this community. Coming to the Milton Hershey School was not easy for me. I did not like the idea of living with people whom I did not know. Little did I know how much those people would later impact my life. As I transitioned into Studio Home Muncie my sophomore year in high school with Mr. and Mrs. Green, the greatest opportunity that I could have ever imagined knocked on my door, a year abroad. Before MHS, traveling abroad was not an option, let alone traveling an entire year. My devoted and compassionate counselor, Dr. Farrar Freeman, helped guide and mentor me through the massive paperwork and many interviews that I had to undergo. When I was officially selected by the Rotary District to travel, I was overjoyed, my parents were in disbelief, and my house parents had that smile on their faces that said, we knew you could do it. Living in Belgium for a year was nothing short of extraordinary. MHS prepared me to live with families whom I did not know and to cope with situations that arose. That opportunity was like no other, and I am very grateful for Milton and Catherine Hershey who made it all possible. They are my spark. A spark cannot continue alone forever, just as a legacy cannot continue without others telling its story. Milton and Catherine Hershey's legacy lives today because we carry it on. This is why I plan to be the spark in the lives of many others outside of the MHS community. After I graduate with the last best class, the class of 2018, I plan to attend a four-year university and then attend medical school. I aspire to become a Doctor Without Borders helping families in third world and developing countries who do not have the opportunity to receive proper health care. I want to be their spark and allow them to share their spark with many others. Thank you.